Hello, beautiful souls. How are you doing? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Hello, Aquarius. How's all of my beautiful souls doing? I love you guys. I love you guys. Yes, I know. I know. Yes, I'm coming to you with another reading. A request, okay? Um, but I love you guys. Thank you for liking and sharing for new viewers, cross watchers. Come on in, take what resonates, okay? Leave the rest for someone else, all right? Reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. I love you guys. I need you to stay with me because there are lessons, blessings, and confirmations in my readings, okay? So we're going to get started. I'm not going to hold you long, Aquarius, and we're going to tap into and see where your vibration is at, my be beautiful souls. How are y'all feeling tonight? How are y'all feeling tonight, okay? So I'm going to pull from the high vibration deck, and let's see where your vibration is. Spirit, guys, I'm all about motivation affirmation. If you don't want to hear motivation affirmation, some of, I get comments only, maybe one person or something. Uh, 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 why is it, you know, I'm not going straight to the tarot reading. It's going to lead to your, to what you need to hear. Now, if you want somebody else, ah, exit the door. So the card came out as smile. Your smile. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it says smile at someone, Aquarius. Look them in the eye and see an amazing human creation. Okay. Miracles are everywhere. In the form of you and every person that you meet. You never know. That smile can turn into a miracle. I'm just saying. Watch where you're at and learn to smile. Because that smile, you never know. And spirit guys, ooh, okay, thank you. Creative expressions, I'll take another one. Spirit guys, I need two more cards for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius. Oh, thank you. I give me clarity, understanding. I actually got two cards that Spirit guys gave me. So your first card, like I said, is Smile Aquarius. Second card is Nature. Okay? Your second card is Nature Aquarius. It says, go outside and breathe the fresh air. Nature is perfection even with its imperfections. It's magical. There you go the word again. Magical. Magical miracles, magical, magical miracles. Listen, a forest need old trees and new trees. It is a perfect balance. Immerse yourself in the middle of it all. Know that you are perfectly placed just where you are. I'm going to say that again for the ones in the back that did not get that. Know that you are perfectly placed just where you are. So that means that Spirit Guys is telling me, Aquarius, that the where you are right now in the chapter of your life, miracles is about to take place. Not only miracles, but there is going to be some magical things that is about to happen in your life. Your next vibration card is food. Food. So Aquarius, it says what you eat affects your vibration. And it does. It does. Today, pay attention to what you are eating. Eat more fruits, veggies, good healthy from the earth nutrition. Receive the high vibes from Mother Earth. Feel the high vibes from Mother Earth and give thanks. Okay, so it's all about what you're eating and your smile. Your smile. So it's all about your smile, what you're eating, what you're intaking. Because there is a lot of there's there's a lot of things that can come that can form in your energetic realm. The energetic realm, Aquarius. And that is miracles. Miracles and magical moments. Okay? So let's see with your... I'm not going to hold you long, but I need you to stay with me, okay? All right? So let's see what's in your um, fortune oracle. Spirit, guys, this is for Aquarius. Mm, you got the dragonfly, Aquarius. Dragonfly is here. Beautiful, abundant, abundant, abundant creature. Have confidence during this time of great joy, renewal, and connection to the spirit. 
Okay? Spirit guides want you to have confidence right now. Have confidence in the very thing that you're manifesting. It's something about your smile. I don't know who you are, but your smile is very contagious. Your smile can bring something out of somebody. It can create a miracle. It can create miracles. I don't know, but it's going to be somebody that you smile at that's going to change your life. Spirit guys, two more cards for Aquarius. So you got the world card, which is a new world. That means that you have shifted. You're on a new timeline. You're in a new, a new uh, shift. That means out with the old, in with the new Aquarius. That means new things. Things are about to happen. Miracles are about to happen. Miracles make way for miracles. Cracker is your second card that is here. And it says positive energy surrounds you. Love, joy, good fortune awaits. So we have that again with these two cards, the dragon and the in the cracker. It is stating love, joy, renewal to the spirit, and fortune is going is awaiting you. This cracker is awaiting you. The bottom of this deck is love. And it says love surrounds all your connections, Aquarius. It says move forward positively in all areas of your life, Aquarius. The bottom of this, the bottom of this deck is um, oh goodness. Spirit God must have wanted me to get that. Those cards was turned over that way. Thought stoppage. Okay, so that was somehow Spirit Guys wanted that out. The thought stoppage that was at the bottom of this deck that I didn't get to read to y'all. This says, are you running negative tapes in your head, Aquarius? You are, on the, you are the one in control of your thoughts. Just tell yourself, stop negative thoughts. Get out of here. You are the one driving your bus. Stop being a passenger and start taking control of your thoughts. Whenever you start to get those 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 negative thoughts that comes into your in your head and your mind, Spirit God says, "Stop it right there. You are in control. You're driving your own bus, baby. You're driving your own bus. You're in control of your own thoughts. Ain't nobody got that wheel but you. Okay. I know we say God take the wheel, but you got control of your thoughts." It's what you allowing into your mind, okay? So, spirit guys, I need, uh, okay, change. It popped out before I even say it. Change, great change is coming. There are some changes coming. Some miracles is about to take place. A miracle is about to take place in your life, Aquarius. I understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. Without movement. That's the only way it's going to change. That's the only way the circumstances, the, the situation is going to change. You got to move it. You got to, got to, got to, got to move it, move it, move it, move it. <laughs> I love you guys, but you got to move it. You got to make, you got to. I understand that nothing can grow and evolve without change. Period. Thank you, spirit guys. Judgment is also here. Stop being hard on yourself. I understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges. Absolutely. No one, who's, who, who can anyone judge? Judge not thyself. And Spirit God says, stop being hard on yourself. You've been too hard on yourself. Now, divine universe, God, divine, uh, your, your ancestors, high spirit, Archangel Michael, Gabriel, you read, they, they don't like, they don't like for us to be hard on ourselves and judge ourselves so harshly. And uh, some of you are definitely judging yourself very harshly. You're being hard on yourself. Regret. Okay. I know that I cannot change the past and you cannot change the past. That's why I feel like a lot of you are being, you're really judging yourself. You're really being hard on yourself about the past, and you can't change it. What is has already happened. You did the best that you can do with the information that you had at the time. You know, you know, you just did the best. So now it's like it's time for you to move on. Okay, you're in a new cycle. 
this change. Allow this change to take place in your life. Beautiful changes. Forgiveness. Orange is somebody's favorite color. Forgiveness, baby. Forgiveness. Forgive yourself. Stop being so hard on yourself. I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. You got to let go of whoever you're resenting, whatever this energy that you're holding on to, that you resent them for something they've done to you. You're blocking your love. You're blocking your blessings. Okay? You got to just let it go. When you let it go, it's going to feel like a ton of weight. It's off of you. But as long as you keep holding on to resentment, on to anger, on to bitterness, on to judgment, judging, who are we to judge? You can't change the past. Let it go. Forgiveness is the key. And embrace this change that's about to happen in your life. Aquarius because you got good things you got mag magic coming you got you got some miracles miracles about to form in your life you got this is a time of joy a time of renewal even to the spirit to your higher self this is a time uh, of, of love and also what what awaits you is good fortune but see the part is you have to believe it and you have to you have to let go of those thought storages, those those negative thoughts that can sometimes consume your mind, your mental state. Because what you think, I said it in my community board, what you think you become. Because you think it long enough, you manifest it. That's why it ain't always what you're speaking. Also, what you think is what you form in your life. Spirit guides is saying, recognize the signs from above, Aquarius, 444, a white dove, butterflies, a feather, uh, coins, you may come across. Those are signs from above, from the angels. Angels are sending you messages now, but you're, you, you're too distracted. Stay alert and be open to the divine guidance. They're sending you messages, but you're, di you're too distracted that you don't even see the messages. Embrace this beautiful change. Embrace this very thing that is about to start to take place in your life. Smile. Your smile can create a miracle in your life. You never know where your smile may lead to. Because you're brightening up somebody else's day that you could be saving someone's life. Yeah, that part. Put your put your creative energy into action, Aquarius. It says Archangel Gabriel joins me to spark your creativity, help you communicate your vision, and motivate you to create something beautiful. Put your creative energy into action is something that you need to do. Some of you are very, very gifted. But in order for you to get the message, in order for you to get the answers and get the connection that you want to, to know what it is that you want to do uh, to, to get some insight on your creativity, you have to stay focused. Some of you are being distracted, too, too, too busy being distracted that you don't even notice that the signs are there. The signs are here. Spirit guys, tell me more for Aquarius. Be a light to others, Aquarius. Okay? You have a powerful message to share. Shine your light on the world so that others can learn from you, Aquarius. Trust your angels. Trust your angels. Honey, that's all you got to do is trust and believe. It says, let go of your expectations of how your dreams will come true. Trust that heaven has a perfect plan just for you. That part wasn't in there. I added that part in there. Trust your angels. They got you. 
Aquarius. Trust your angels. Forgive yourself. Any other message? Archangel Michael is here as well. And trust in the divine. So you got Archangel Gabriel here with you. And you have Archangel Michael here with you. That's going to help resolve this solution. This situation that some of you may be facing or going through. You're having a hard time wanting to accept this change that is about to happen into your life. This world card. The new the world card is out with the old. In with the new. New things. New beginnings. New something's coming in for you. Miracles. Okay, and Archangels, even though you can't see it, Archangel Michael is saying, I am actively working on this situation. I am here and I am helping you, Aquarius. Trust in the divine purpose. This experience has divine meaning. Healing will come. Know that you are on a path of growth. You just got to believe it. You got to stay focused and believe it because, baby, something is coming in. There's a blessing coming in that's in disguise. There's a blessing coming. The angels is bringing an angel, a blessing in disguise towards you. You're not going to see this coming. This is going to be far more than you have ever expected. <laughs> this is for somebody. <laughs> and it says, be patient. And have faith that your angels, you got angels around you. Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Michael Gabriel, you got angels, you got miracles. You got miracles here, you got magical moments, you got blessings that is in disguise that you just don't have a clue. It says, have faith that your angels have this situation under control. What will come is far better than you dared to dream. I don't know who I'm talking to tonight, but there is a miracle. There is something coming towards you that is a blessing in disguise. And it's far more than you can ever imagine. It's coming into your life. This is a magical moment. This is a this is this is definitely some beautiful, some beautiful energy, some beautiful, some a miracle is coming. And at the behind that, it said, "Take just take control of your thoughts, Aquarius. Take control of your thoughts. You are what you think. What you think, what you think becomes. It manifests. Your thoughts are creating your reality. I cannot I cannot express it enough. Have faith and stay focused on the outcome that you truly deserve." It's all about your thoughts. It's all about what you're thinking. It's all about what you're manifesting through your thoughts. This is your reality, not mine. What you want in your reality, your higher self, your vibration, your frequency. You're in a, you're in a whole new timeline. You have shifted into another timeline. You have the world card here. That's out with the old, in with the new. New things, new miracles, blessings coming. Blessings in disguise that you do not recognize. That it's going to be far more than you have ever, ever, <laughs> ever imagined. Okay. Spirit, guys, divine universe, please come to me. I need you to give me clarity, understanding. What is the reading for my beautiful Aquariuses? <laughs> Aquarius, you got some blessings in disguise coming. This change, get ready for a change. This is a change, a whirlwind of changes coming into your life. But spirit guys want you to make sure that you smile. In spite of, smile. A smile gonna, <laughs> that smile is going to do something. I feel like that's where your miracle coming in at. Is your smile, Aquarius. Ten of Cups, your smile. Some of you have met someone that you're happy with or you're going to meet somebody that you're happy with. Council Scorpio Pisces, you're either going to have children or you're going to blend your children together. Or you're going to have two children by this person. You're going to, whatever the situation is going to be. You've been in isolation. But you've persevered a lot. You've persevered a lot. Yes, your heart has been broken. Um, many different places. Your heart has been broken. You know, but you have persevered. These two cards together, you have persevered. You did it. You made it through that lesson, life lessons. Now you're in a new chapter of your life. 
Now you're in, in a chapter of change and uh, in newness. Blessings in disguise, Aquarius. Spirit guys, tell me more for Aquarius. Tell me more. Thank you. Stop looking back on what you lost. Stop looking back on what didn't work. Stop looking back on nostalgia memories. It's okay to kind of glance back there, but don't stay back there. Spirit guys say, don't hold yourself back. Because you got, if you lift your head up, if you don't, if you don't lift your head up, you don't know where you're going. How can you see where you're going if you're walking with your head down? How can you see what's in front of you if you're not looking up? Chin up, chest out. That's the food card. Chin up, chest out. All right? You got two options back here. You got two opportunities back here behind you. But you're too busy focusing over here what's laying on the ground that did not work, that disappointed you, that, that let you down, that cheated, lied to you, and manipulated you. But Spirit God said, I need you to lift your head up and look up. Because I have some opportunities that's right there in front of your face and you don't see it. Some of you are right in front of somebody that you don't see. And that is your, uh, that is your miracle. Somebody is right in front of you that you're not even paying attention. And that is, that is a blessing in disguise. But in order for you to see it, you have to look up. And you got to quit dwelling on what did not work out for you. And realize that you learned your lesson and you healed and you're moving on to a new new, a new a era. Uh, you, you're moving on to new vibrations, a new shift, a different timeline. And you got to let this go and, stay, and, and lift your head up so you can see the two blessings. There's something that's behind you, something that's been right in front of you, but you haven't paid it no attention. That is a blessing in disguise. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. But there's somebody or something or somebody that you're overlooking, and that's a blessing in disguise. There's somebody right there. But you've been too focused on what you, what you don't have, what you lost, what you don't got. What somebody done, when they done it, how they done it, da, da, da. You're too busy looking back and you're in isolation about it and you're looking back on nostalgia memories. Spirit God said, come out of it. Come out of it. Trust your angels. Trust your spirit guides. Trust your spirit team. Trust your higher source. Whoever you believe in, your ancestors with vibra high vibration. Archangel Michael, Gabriel, Uriel, whoever you believe in. A lot of angels are around you. But you got to, in order for you to see it, you know, you got to lift your head up. Because you can't see where you're going with your head down. That's for somebody. Who are you? Who is that for? Who is this message for? Who is this message for? Sometimes we can miss the very blessing that's sitting right in front of us and don't realize it. I'm just saying this is for somebody. Yep, you're overlooking. You're, 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 you're looking in the wrong direction. Spirit guys is just bringing it to my energy, Aquarius. Somebody's looking in the wrong direction. You're looking back at what you lost, and you got somebody right in front of you that's ready to fulfill your life, that's ready to have the Ten of Cups with you. This is a blessing in disguise. Spirit guys has been sending you angel numbers, angel messages, and you have been so uh, distracted that you have not seen them. You're not paying attention to the signs. Tower moment. Your life is about to shift very heavy. Something suddenly is about to come into your life. Something suddenly is about to happen. A miracle is about to happen. Something suddenly is about to happen. This is a blessing in disguise. You're not, this is going to be far more than what you have ever expected. The tower moment is here. This is going to shock the living crap out of somebody. I don't know who you are. I don't know your life. So Spirit Guys is saying, told you, chin up. Chin up, chest out, baby. Chin up, chest out. It's time to take that leap of faith. Some of you about to take that leap of faith and walk away from somebody. 
Some of you getting ready to take a leap of faith and, and walk away and, and accept this new change in your life. I don't know who you are, but I just got to chill. I just, Spirit God, just touch me. Somebody about to walk away from a Cancer Scorpio Pisces. It doesn't necessarily mean that. It could be any sign. That's just what this card represents. But you chin it up and you, yeah, your chest is out and your chin is up. And you ready to take a new leap of faith with your dog, cat, rat, chat. I don't know what kind of animal you got. But you ready to take a leap of faith and you ready to start a new beginning. You get ready to take a chance. You get ready to take, you about to be a fool for something. I don't know who you are. But you're about to, you about, you about to, you about to walk right into your miracle. This change, you said, I'm ready. You taking a risk and you don't care what nobody say. You don't care what nobody think. You taking this change. You making this change. And you taking this leap of faith. And angels, guys, this is this is emotions. King of Cups, all about emotions. You've been at a crossroad trying to make a, a decision about this. You've been, you've been losing sleep. You've been aggravated at the same time. But you know you need to walk away because you've been stuck with this Gemini Libra Aquarius. You've been stuck in this situation. And you know it's time for a change. You know it. You know it, don't you? You know it. Only you can create your reality, baby. Only you. Only you can create your happiness. Only you. Only you. Only you can make me happy. Hey. Happy. Hey. Happy. Only you can make you happy. Yeah. Ha, happy, yeah. Yeah, you walking away, baby. That's right. That's right. That's right. You walking away. You walking away. You tired of the selfishness. You tired of the selfishness. You defending, you protecting your heart, defending your territory. Only you can make you happy, yeah. Hey, happy, yeah. Only you can make you happy. You got to take this leap of faith and you got to make this change and you got to realize that, uh uh, no, I'm done. I'm done. I'm doing what makes me happy. I'm tired of going through all of these sores with this person. I'm tired of unemotional. I'm tired. I'm not at a crossroad no more. I know what I want. It's, gonna, it's making some of you cry, some of you uh, are emotional, but this is going to be good for you. This is going to be real good for you, Aquarius. I love you guys. Only you can make you happy. What makes you happy? What do you want? This is your reality. This is your story. I am Positive Thoughts of Energy, Aquarius. Until next time.